I am not a hacker, but hackers are so cool and I want to be cool. People don't even think I'm a hacker. Trust me, I ask. But maybe I can trick the government into thinking I'm a hacker. That ends well for everyone who tries it. The bar here is incredibly low. The Missouri governor just called a journalist a hacker because they looked at a website's HTML code. That's the public source code. You know, the code that is actually the websites we see, It's that's all it is, is code. And as we all know, a governor is the entire US government. It's in the constitution. So if I view a web page's source code, I am a hacker and therefore I'm cool, legally, according to the government. I'm gonna do it. Here we go. So this is what it feels like. Although that was not long enough or interesting enough to count as a YouTube video. There are rules for these things, so let's make it harder. I'm going to try to trick the almighty algorithms into thinking I'm a hacker. Here's the plan. I need to train a machine learning model to recognize a hacker. Then I'll feed the neural network at my video feed and it will compare me to what it thinks a hacker looks like. For any machine learning model to work, you need to have a data set to start with. So we're gonna go to Google and download the first couple hundred image results for hacker. Yeah, yeah this looks accurate. This will become what's known as our first class, the hacker class. If I only feed the algorithm hacker images though, the only thing it will ever know is hackers and call everything a hacker. Kind of like the Missouri governor. So we need more classes, things that are like hackers, but definitely not hackers. So let's pick more classes and then grab the top image results for those classes. All right, I need ideas and images. Hacker, hacker, snacker? Hackers don't snack. Uh, packer? filter for football, and how about baby? This video needs more cute, and why not? The coolest cat of them all, Electro Boom. I wonder if I can get the algorithm to think I'm Electro Boom. <laughs> so I'm loading all my data sets into the site Teachable Machine. This is not sponsored, but they were at the top of my Google search, so they, they must know algorithms, right? Let's get training. Choo choo, little train engineer humor for you. Okay, there are some parameters here we can tweak. Epochs are how many times it works through the training set. Batches are how many samples at once it looks at before updating the model as it loops through the set. Training these machine learning models is just kind of like a for loop. My images are loaded, my machine learning algorithm is trained, and my neural network is ready to rock. Time to turn on my camera. Let's start by feeding it just me here sitting normally at my desk. Okay, right now it looks like I'm a little bit hacker, a little bit baby, and a lot of bit electro boom. And I'm gonna to try to get a solid 100% electro boom at the very end of this video. Before I try to trick this neural network into classifying me as a hacker, let's see if I can trick it into thinking I'm these other classes. I'm only gonna use what I have here in my office to try and fool it. Let's start with Packer. If I look at the data set, I'm gonna need like green and yellow. Um, so let's turn the lights. That's kind of green, yellow. Um, ooh, okay. Bananas. Ah. Here we go. This is kind of, kind of Packer. Boom. Take that, Aaron Favre. I don't know, sports ball. For the next one, we're going for snack. So bananas seem like the obvious choice. Um, it's a little bit baby. Aha, I found the LED remote, which controls the LEDs behind me. Ooh, a little bit of RGB, a little bit of hacker. Nope. Okay, let's try this. Yeah, full snack, baby. I always knew I could be a snack if I tried. Next up, baby. We're definitely gonna need some white light in the background. And babies have kind of big eyes compared to their heads. So I've been sitting on these big googly eyes, hoping a day like this would come. Let's see if they work. Oh, it's touching on baby. Okay, babies don't wear glasses. Okay, I'm getting a little bit of baby. How do we get 100% baby? Um, let's look at these pictures. Oh man, you know what I'm gonna have to do? The things I do for YouTube views. Okay, I'll be selling bath water later. 
And that is how a grown man tricks an algorithm into thinking he's a baby. Okay, watch this. Apparently the algorithm thinks babies don't have pupils. Oh, that's a freebie. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> You're in my office now, come here. Yeah. It turns out this model works super well for actual babies, so <laughs> it must think I'm a baby. Yeah. And now the real test, hacker. If I look at this data set, it's clear that I need more RGB and a black hoodie. I don't own a black hoodie, but I do have a, a jacket. I think this will do the trick. Oh yeah, boop beep boop, hand me a Mountain Dew. <laughs> oh, I just can't. Hand me, boop beep boop, hand me a Mountain Dew. I just took a DNA machine learning test and it turns out I'm 100% that hacker. That might be the worst line I've ever written. Now, I'm not a machine learning expert, but there are machine learning pros here at Keysight. We use it in our Fault Hunter and the MXR oscilloscopes and our eggplant software test automation platform. In fact, I will be sitting down with Steve Wozniak and some machine learning experts from Keysight here on October 28th. Go sign up for that event now using the link down below. I'm also giving away a huge build your own test automation studio. And if there's a question you want me to ask Woz, you can put it in the comments of this video and I'll ask him some of those questions. Go sign up, especially if you work with software, there's some really cool machine learning AI tricks you can use. I'm really looking forward to this event. We're giving away a bunch of swag, some Waz sign stuff. Now let's see if I can go from 100% hacker to 100% electro boom. That almost works, but apparently like baby unibrows are a thing. My eyebrows are not as epic as his, but from lunch I have a knife and this uh, fixture. <laughs> that is like, Rock solid electro boom. Oh my gosh.